Mr. Chairman, committee, my name is Brandon Olson, OLSEN. Um, I've worked in the timber industry all my life. I come from a part of Montana where that's big. Right now there are no jobs. The businesses that still that are still open aren't hiring anymore. They're laying off. Many, many of my friends and coworkers have been un unemployed for over two years now. Uh, I was lucky enough to be hired by a dispensary as an employee. I have my first child on its way now. I don't want to go on unemployment. Um, through my job now, I have had the opportunity to speak to many medical marijuana patients. Many of them hear their testimonies. Uh, many of them have given up their cocktails of uh, narcotics and prescription drugs, morphine, oxycontin, oxycodone, in favor of medical cannabis. They say it helps them better. Uh, there's far less dangerous side effects. Uh, they feel better. They've never felt better. I, I don't think that this bill is, has the, the patient's best interest in mind. I believe it favors the drug companies, the pharmaceutical companies. I'll bet they're really up in arms over this medical marijuana thing. They want it stopped, I'm sure. Um, my stepfather, a year and a half ago, passed away. He had cancer. He didn't pass away from the cancer. He passed away from the prescription drugs that were given to him. Now, I don't know if medical cannabis could have helped him. I've talked to a lot of ca uh, cancer patients and cancer survivors who swear by it. It's, it's the reason they're alive. But I think I do know that whether it helped him or not, he wouldn't have died from medical cannabis. Um, thank you for your time.